Netball started for me when I was at primary school, maybe around five or six, I'm not too sure. Um, but everyone was playing it, my friends, just probably the only sport that was available <laughs> to the girls at school. Um, so yeah, just primary school and friends. My favourite memory will probably be um, Under-23s Nationals, like four years ago. Um, it was my dad's last tournament that he came to watch, so that was pretty special to me, and probably Botswana as well, Under-21 World Cup. Point in my life where I thought netball could be a career was probably Beko, um, but it was always a dream and always something that I was striving for, but the realisation of it coming true was probably around Beko when you get your, you know, your first call from the ANZ coach saying that, you know, they're watching you and you like get real excited and yeah, and here I am now. Uh, Botswana was pretty special. Um, there was a two and a half year build up to that, um, and to make the final twelve was pretty awesome. And coming off the first Magic season, um, and then going over there and just kind of playing our New Zealand game and and mixing with the locals and beating Aussie in the final was <laughs> cherry on top. Choosing netball over other sports was a big choice that you have to make. You can't play all of them all the time. Um, just spending time with family is probably a hard one for me because I live three hours away from Hamilton. I know other people live further, but just getting home is is kind of hard, but they know and yeah, just do it as much as I can. I've had a lot of important people help me through my journey, my nan, my my mum, my dad, um, just everyone around me, everyone when I moved to Hamilton, just so much support there, and just my Magic family. My favourite part of being involved in the sport is probably how many young kids that you can reach out to and how much of a role model you are in the community, um, and also the competitive nature of the competition and getting to play alongside some of your childhood heroes is pretty cool. Yeah, I've been in the sort of environment for a little bit now, kind of in and out, but you take every opportunity you can and it's always good going into the high performance environment and just seeing how they, seeing how everybody else does, you know, does them and trying to find out who I am and finding my place in that high performance zone.